is uh, number 40. <laughs> the periodic table. I'm like, we have to check. I have to write down the numbers. With the You're number just giving this them is, numbers. <laughs> this is this is this is zirconium. Zirconium. So I was at the Gem and Jewelry show with my girlfriend and a man I thought would ask me to marry him one day. And my girlfriend stopped at a booth amongst the rows and rows of vendors and told me to look at a huge engagement ring. Well, I didn't want to look. I didn't want to get my hopes up. But seeing the brilliance of the awe-inspiring stones made me ask for the price of one particular ring. They told us it was $375. And we were confused. This ring should be at least two grand. But then we saw that this was a booth of cubic zirconia jewelry. How disappointing. We thought we want the real thing. But looking back, I had to admit that the zirconium was unmistakably breathtaking. I don't know if zirconium is as short-lived as that relationship with the man that went with me to the Gem and Jewelry <laughs> show in Chicago that I thought was going to ask me to marry him one day. But if nothing else, at least some zirconium would have been a nice gesture. Although the element zirconium's most common oxide is zirconium dioxide, also known as zirconia, used as a common diamond substitute, the metallic element zirconium is a lustrous, grayish-white, soft, ductile, and malleable element different from a diamond, I suppose, but also different from the cubic zirconia isotope. Uh, it must, I just have to keep remembering that cubic zirconium is not all zirconium is used for. It was used for not only nuclear applications, but also in the space and aeronautics industries. Zirconium is used for cladding nuclear reaction fuels, and materials from zirconium metal and its oxide are even used in space vehicle parts for their resistance to heat. A zirconium isotope has even been recently using positron emission tomography at cameras. So, ductile or not, maybe zirconium is pretty strong, and exactly at times what I need. Positron emission tomography. Oh, okay. yeah. All I could the, think of is some people do put cameras on their pets. No, 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 like PET scans. What difference would it make? No, 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 no,